Hi there, this is Robert Thompson with Artisan Real Estate, and I'm here with Daniel Gonzalez from DG Pressure Washing, just to uh, talk with him and talk a little bit about what he does with this company. So, Daniel, how are you? I'm good. Good, good. Um, why don't you tell us what you're doing out there with DG Pressure Washing? Yeah, sure. So, I started college uh, last fall, about a little over a year ago, uh, and three months later, I started a business to, to try to make my way through college. Awesome. And it in that first year it took off, and now we just wrapped up our first year, and I have uh, three total employees, most of them real low hours, uh, just kind of part time as a side hustle. But right. uh, some people helping me out, and it's it's been really great. So, and you you I remember you telling me that your goal was to graduate because you and your wife are both in school. Is yeah, that, yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm married. We're both in school. Uh, we're we're living in a basement and being as frugal as we can as we go through college. Uh, and she's going to school for nursing as I'm going to school for business. And you want to graduate and be debt-free, debt right? Yeah. Huh? So that's a great idea. Yeah. Um, so what kind of stuff does your company do? What do, uh, you do? So we do gutter cleanings and roof treatments and uh, like pressure washing concrete and flat work or painted decks and stuff like that. Basically, if it has to do with exterior cleaning, we can offer it or we can refer it. So things like landscaping and windows, we have we have great connections for that. Too. You've got peeps. We got peeps. Right on. <laughs> you were telling me earlier about, a, you know, you had read an article on the National Association of Realtors. He asked me if I knew about the National Association of Realtors, which I do, as it turns out. <laughs> um, uh, an article that they had published about pressure washing the house for sellers. What did that article say? Yeah, so uh, the National Association of Realtors claims that by washing the outside of a house, you can add up to $15,000 to the sale price of the home. Right, so that's a pretty significant number if you're thinking about selling your home, you know, keep that in mind. It's the, it's the curb appeal effect, I assume, is what they're talking about, but that's a big number. Voting. I don't so. know how they get that number, but uh, they're yeah, third yeah. party and they say a big one. So Right, right, right. right. Well, they, that's, <laughs> we were joking that maybe uh, maybe the NAR is in cahoots with the pressure washers of the world and they're you know, getting kickbacks, but I don't think that's big the case. Big pressure washing is uh, very <laughs> that, that, that's right. That's right. Big tobacco and big pressure washing. Um, Okay, well, anything else about your company that uh, you feel like throwing out there? Um, oh, yeah. I mean, um, one of the, the most expensive things to replace in a home is the roof, and we do roof treatments, and so we know some stuff about keeping a roof clean, uh, and please don't pressure wash it. Also, the zinc powder stuff, the, the uh, Asphalt Roofing Manufacturers Association does not recommend uh, zinc or copper strips. They recommend using soft washing, and that involves bleach, so I recommend using a pro. Right, so they do that stuff. Where are, where all do you work? What's your territory? Uh, so we're based out of Woodburn, which means that we can service all of Portland and Salem because we're halfway in between. Okay, mm -hmm. okay, because I, I live in Malala, and he used to live in Malala, and I know he comes out that way, so. Yeah. All right, well, any last thoughts? Uh, no, just, just gratitude and uh, excitement. All right. Yeah. <laughs> well, Daniel Gonzalez, DG Pressure Washing. You find him on Facebook, or you can get a hold of me if you want to find him, and uh, does great stuff. So, thanks for joining us. See thanks you later. So much. Bye.